of the mountain. Nick Black is driving in six underground. It's a 2016 Alfa Romeo Giulia weighing 87.5 grams. Up next, we have Terrence Jr. of Redline Salvage Inc. driving in the Purple People Eater. It's an 08 Lancer Evolution weighing 114.2 grams. Looks like he has some FTEs on that one. Well, if it was built by Redline Salvage, it's probably gonna be fast. Then we have Burt Buzzer driving in Get Rotored. It's a Mazda RX-7 with very large wheels. Really big. Weighing 113.3 grams. He's driving for Outback Creek Racing. And last up we have 213 Racing driving in the Snowbird. The Snowbird is a Volvo 850 Estate weighing 88 grams. Here we go, race one of five. The top driver will advance on to the third tournament in King of the Mountain. Terrence Jr. already off to a big lead in that purple Evo. 213 racing in second in that Volvo. Oh man, I can already see where this race is going. Yeah, the other drivers appear to be outmatched by Terrence Jr. I mean, just look at that. A big win there by Terrence Jr. and he gets a track time of 16.428 seconds. A close call at the intersection. All the drivers made it down the mountain in one piece. I think they're hoping to avoid any police activity tonight. Wow, that was a close call between Nick Black and 213 Racing. That was super close. Here it is again. Oh, wow, man. how did they not hit? I don't know, but that was a close one. Here we go with race two. We've got Terrence Jr. on the front right and 213 Racing on the front left. I don't think that Volvo has any chance against that Evo. Evo certainly do have a reputation of being fast on the mountain although it does depend on who built it. Nah, it's all about who's behind the wheel, and Terrence Jr. knows what he's doing. Terrence Jr. way ahead. He's followed by 2 and 3 Racing, but he's way back there. And Terrence Jr. picks up his second win back to back. And look at that, another 16 second time. Terrence certainly has some skills behind the wheel. That second win puts him ahead by four points. He has a total of 10, 2 and 3 Racing with six. Nick Black and Burt Buzzard both with three. Look at the way he's handling these corners with speed and precision. Yeah, his exits on those corners are really clean. I don't think these other guys have a chance. Well, the next two races, Terrence Jr. will be starting from the back. Let's see if he can find his way around the front row. We have two and three racing on the front right in the Volvo and Burt Buzzard in the Mazda RX-7 with the really big wheels. Too big. It's a little oversized. 2-1-3 racing in the lead with Terrence Jr. bump drafting off his tail. 2-1-3 pulling ahead now. Terrence Jr. in pursuit in that Evo. They're rounding the final corner, and here comes Terrence Jr. Whoa. at the finish line. Whoa! What a race right down to the checkered flag. We're going to have to go to replay to see who won that. If Terrence Jr. got that one, that's going to be three wins in a row. Let's see. Here they come. Oh, he was ah. so close. Check out that time though. So far, every race tonight has been in the 16 second range. Some fast racing for sure, but that's what happens when you get a fast Evo on the track. Terrence Jr. putting on a good show here. Two and three racing, moving up in points. He now has 11. That puts him two behind Terrence Jr. Both two and three racing and Terrence Jr. starting from the back row. We've got Burt Buzzard and Nick Black in the front. Nick Black leading down the straight in that green Alfa Romeo. I think he's getting pushed by Terrence. Terrence Jr. in second, he's going for the pass. Nick Black with some serious blocking there. Nick Black spins out. Terrence Jr. trying to get him out of the way. Burt Buzzard right there with him. Here they come out of the final corner. Terrence Jr. pulling ahead now. Here he comes. And Terrence Jr. will take his third win of the night. Look at that 3D, it's all over. Oh, it is, Terrence Jr. has a seven point lead. So we will not be running the fifth race. Terrence Jr. is your winner of the night and will be advancing on to the third tournament in King of the Mountain. You've got to admire his determination right here. He was getting blocked all kinds of ways by that Alfa Romeo, but he kept pushing and pushing until he found his way through. Yeah, that Evo is definitely gonna be a contender for the crown in this tournament. Here's a look at the current qualifiers. Terrence Jr. is currently sitting in third place with that track time of 16.428 seconds. Look at that, his car is almost the same weight as Luke H's fatty, 
but right between them is Mickey Fumes in a 72 gram car. Well, it's not always about weight. That's what I keep telling the missus. What? She wants me to get on a diet. Well, that might not be a bad idea. Uh, 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 you already said it. It's not always about the weight. Yeah, but that was about the car. You're 3D bot maker. I'm 2D. And you've been watching King, King of, of the, the Mountain. Mountain. You could have let me say my line. I think you said enough. I was just. Oh, oh look at that. Someone unplugged your mic. Okay, that's hey, Steve, we doing tofu or tacos tonight?